welcome back, welcome back, y'all. It's your girl from Amethyst Rose to Rose. I'm going to do the, you guys an energy check in, see what is being most important for this time or at this time. The message is timeless. However, when you see it is when you're meant to see it, okay? So, we got this little dice right here, okay? We're going to roll it twice. We're playing the process of elimination to determine who goes next. Only, you know, only person who knows who goes next is spirit. So let's see who's next. We're going to roll it twice, add the number up, process of elimination. If we've already done it, we'll move along. All right, let's see. Five. All right. One more time. Six. All right, so 11 house. So that is Aquarius. So Aquarius is up next. All right, so what we got for Aquarius? What messages do you have for Aquarius spirit? What should they know? What is the most important for Aquarius? What's the message? Tell us about it. Tell us what the message is for Aquarius. Sisters, what messages do you have for Aquarius? Some are rising in the North Node. What is being most important at this time? Archangel Michael, please protect me. As I channel this message for the Aquarius, someone rising in the North Node, block any interference. It stops their message from coming through. What's going on with Aquarius? Aquarius. I just seen a four of pentacles. Okay, you got the Three of Cups with the Nine of Swords and the Seven of Swords and the Four of Swords and the Knight of Swords. I just, somebody living in hell. That's what I just heard. Gonna Love Me by Tiana Taylor. Somebody, somebody living in hell. Could be this King of Pentacles, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. What's up with Aquarius? Something could be in regards to a home. Somebody childish. Somebody somebody could have betrayed somebody, backstabbed somebody, left somebody for big, uh, dead, heart painful ending. Queen of Cups here. Something has something to do with somebody's baby mother, their mother. Um, this could just have something to do with a water sign, feminine, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Somebody could be reconciling here, an earth sign, masculine, and a water sign, male. Could be moving in together, reconciling and moving in. You got that ten of swords came right back out. A harsh, painful ending. So one was already here. You got judgment at the bottom of the deck. I'm sorry, not judgment, justice. So something could be uh, uh, dealing with the Libra. Page of swords here. Somebody could be watching you. So somebody sees that they need, sees that somebody is traveling or um, that they need to say something. Somebody feels like they need to say something. Could be in regards to a Gemini, Scorpio, Cancer, maybe all three people. I'm like, I heard an announcement. I don't know what this is about. Six of Cups. Yeah, something could be dealing with some kind of memory. Somebody, somebody is, somebody is looking back at old memories. Uh, yeah, reminiscing. Somebody could be missing somebody here. Okay, that too. <laughs> Ace of Wands. Somebody could, if you guys have made love, want to make love to you. Somebody is thinking about your sex. <laughs> oh my goodness, Aquarius. Somebody has unforgettable sex. That's what I'm getting from this. So somebody wants to like go to your house or they want you to come to theirs or something like that. You got the fool here. That's you, Aquarius. Okay, Knight of Cups. Yeah. 
So, <laughs> yeah, somebody's somebody's crying over spilled milk here. Somebody's sad. They're feeling regretful. Somebody hate that they missed the opportunity here. Somebody could have blocked you out or uh, just been combative with you. Um, wanting to play a tit for tat game with you or something like that. Be petty or something like that. Be childish, you know. Oh, I'm going to say something, see what they're going to say back. I'm going to do something, see what they're going to say. You know, type of childish behavior, strength card. Yeah. And somebody is really holding back. They try, they try not to look at you. They try not to think about you, but they can't help it. Broken Hearted by Brandy just came on. Yeah, somebody is, they want to communicate. They're thinking about it. They're thinking about communicating with you. They're thinking about how I'm going to do it. Somebody is in deep thought, Aquarius. Somebody wants to reconcile. Somebody actually wants to come towards you to reconcile. Somebody killed something with a third party, though. Somebody is over that. That's done. This King of Pentacles is sad. So somebody held back and was resistant and very prideful um, with this Queen of Cups. Somebody who was very loving, compassionate. Okay? Somebody who's very attractive. Attracted to them. They were there was a there was a connection here though. This could be a past life soulmate. You and this person could be meant to be married or something like that. Not trying to take it too deep, but you guys had a magical connection with each other. Tell me about the four of wands. Why the four of wands here? This is for Aquarius. I just seen the star, but we're going to put it back because they all flipped all out. Four of wands. Ten of swords. Somebody betrayed somebody. I seen the eight of wands. Somebody could have said something. Somebody betrayed somebody. Somebody said they were going to do something that they didn't do. Or somebody lied. Like the type of lies you got to, like, how, like, how I'm going to undo these lies. You got the empress here. Something could be dealing with a Libra. Somebody could be with child. What's the ten of one? Ten of swords. I don't know why I keep saying ten of wands. So somebody made a decision here. Willingly made a decision here to walk away from something. Somebody cut somebody off because somebody was breadcrumbing somebody. So somebody turned their back on this person with the three of wands that we've seen there. But what's the three of cups? Why is the three of cups here? Thank you. The moon. So somebody could have been kept a secret. Whatever this is, um, somebody could have been kept a secret here. Something is dealing with a Libra though. For some Aquarius. What's the fool? Something was hidden here about this third party. Somebody could have had somebody pregnant, but they never told you about it. This could have been before you, the sun. So somebody, somebody is, uh, hmm, so somebody wants to, uh, there's something about a marriage and, or something like that, a marriage. Somebody's taking a leap towards that happiness. The fool in the sun, please. Somebody is dealing with a Leo. The ten of pentacles. Yeah, somebody wants a family with somebody. They don't want to play and party anymore. They don't want to do whatever the secret is. What's this secret? I'm seeing a nine of cups. Somebody could just like to do something too much. Magician. Somebody Somebody just loves to manipulate people. Could be a Sagittarius. Yeah. Somebody just loves to play games. They, they, they Yeah. But now they're sad. Why is the five of cups here? Why are they sad? Because they love to play games. They love to play games. Somebody really loves to play games. Like, it's everything is a game. The hermit. They sad because now they're in isolation. They probably aren't they lonely? <laughs> what the? What the? <laughs> that ain't funny. That is not funny. All right. You got the three of wands with the six of wands. 
Nine of Wands. Okay. Tell me about this page of swords. Who is who is who's spying? The devil, Capricorn is spying on you, Aquarius. Somebody that you could have been intimate with in the past. Tell me about the strength card. Somebody could be somebody could watch porn, so they're sad because they're not really being intimate with you. The strength card is clarified by the King of Cups. So there could be a Leo male in their feelings here. Somebody could also be going through a transformation. Somebody wants to communicate a rebirth with you, though. But somebody is like, no. What's the Ace of Wands? Like It by Summer Walker. Yeah, somebody likes being single. Four of Swords here. All right. Somebody could be ill at this time. Somebody could have an STD or something like that. What's the Ace of Wands and the Four? Can I get another one for the Ace of Wands and the um, Four of Swords? Mm -mm. Ace of Wands and the Four of Swords, please. Thank you. Thank you. Strength. Yeah, somebody trying to hold on. Somebody, somebody trying to hold back from having sex, though. So I don't know if this is something new or somebody is resisting something. Somebody is real stubborn. Why is the Six of Cups here? Six of Cups for Aquarius. Please and thank you. I deal with the love of right hand. Six of Cups for Aquarius. What does Aquarius need to know? I seen the Wheel of Fortune. We got the Two of Cups. All right, so this person is receiving, they could be receiving karma right now. But something, but something is their karma is to feel lonely, be lonely, whatever this is. Somebody needs to detox from some kind of toxicity, something they have going on. One thing that I can say though is that whatever it is or whatever happened, whatever this commitment was with this Libra or whoever this person is, this third party energy, you would know who this person is. Um, but that done, and it was a harsh, painful ending at that. It was missing. But something is fated to come back around again with you and this person. Uh, what I'm going to do, you have free will. You got the uh, five. So it's the same person right here. It could be a Virgo. It was very toxic. But I'm going to get one card just to uh, clarify uh, best course of action. What what because it that whatever this is, this partnership is coming back around again. It's fated to be that way. You do have free will. Somebody is just only you know, would know what, what this is about, um, or who this is, but it's somebody that's sad, could be a Leo or somebody who has a highly aspected, could be anybody, could be a Virgo. But it could be a Sagittarius. Yeah, somebody wasn't the best person to you. All right. What's the best course of action for this For this right here? The Six of Cups, the Two of Cups, and the Wheel of Fortune. What's the best course of action when this happens? What do you suggest, Spirit? What's going on here? The Six of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune, Two of Cups. Breaking Point. By Carrie Hilson out the album No Boys Allowed. So, the best course of action, or what they want you to know, is the Ten of Cups with the Six of Cups. You got the Nine of Coins with the Knight of Cups. So, somebody wants to propose that you not be single anymore, 
But whatever this is, this turn, this comeback around is gonna be good. It's gonna be everything you ever dreamed of. This person is a past life soulmate here. You know this person from like you guys have reincarnated another lifetime with each other. So that's what this is. So it doesn't have to be this old person per se to your face. All right. However, it could be. You would know what this is. Let's get a um affirmation. Yeah. for Aquarius. Yeah, something that reached its breaking point. So that Ten of Swords, whatever something, what, whatever this was, that faulty foundation, that's done. That's over with. What affirmation could Aquarius use at this time? What affirmation could they use at this time, Spirit? Instead of worrying about the future, I know all is well when I'm aligned in the moment. That's right. This is going to circle back to you, but just keep on doing what your part, doing what you do. I let the universe catch up with my dreams. I know that's right, baby. We already ahead of whatever this is. So give it time. It'll come. It'll catch back up to you. Okay, Aquarius. All right. That is your reading. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.